Alright guys, I'm in Adobe Illustrator and I just wanted to show you guys how you're going to make your cards for your board game. If I hit Command N, I should be able to get a new document. Um, recent is the letter size, but if you don't have that, go to Print, select Letter, change it to Inches, hit Create. Okay, so now I have my document. I'm going to hit Command R to get my rulers to show up. I'm going to move the document over. And then I'm going to zoom in. Okay, so I can get a better view of my ruler and then I'm going to click and drag on the ruler and I'm going to get some non-printing guides and I do them about a half inch from the edge of the paper. Um, the reason why I do this is because our printer does not print full bleed so it doesn't print something all the way to the edges. Let me do my half inch at the bottom. Okay so these non-printing guides are placed and then I'm just going to create a rectangle. I'm just going to follow my guide and I know the size of this needs to be under the transform. I'm going to tr change it to 3.75 to 2 inches and it'll automatically resize it there. Okay so that gives me an outline for my cards and then I'm just going to click and drag. I have lorem ipsum but I'm going to say um, type in the directions for my, car my card so I'm going to say um, follow directions on this card. And you can always change um, your character here and I could go ahead and definitely increase the point size. Okay, maybe that's a little too big. And I could hit 20. Okay, then what I'm going to do is I'm going to put one more non-printing guide for the middle. Okay, and then I'm going to click and drag. I'm going to hit Command G to group this, and then I'm going to hold the Option key, and then I'm going to click and drag. And I'm going to line it up. Okay, if it's still not lined up, or I want to double check that it's lined up, I hold the Shift key and I click on the objects, and then I hit Vertical Align at the top, and then I'm going to select both the objects, hold the Option key, click and drag, and then I'm just going to line it up. I can grab all four, click and drag, and so this is what we call ganging it up in printing. And then I just need two more. So I'm just going to grab the last two and line them up. You can always, if something's off, you can use your arrow keys um, just to kind of line it back up. Okay. And if I hit command and a semicolon, I can get rid of those non-printing guides. Okay. So I have that. I'm going to hit command S. Call it game cards. And I can leave it as an AI file and click Save. I'm going to hit Replace because I already have that file. And I'm just going to leave it as Illustrator CC and click OK. All right, and that's how you make your cards.